Hello, I'm Skid, and welcome to episode, I've lost count, 17, 18? One sec, I can get this information quickly enough. 18 of my Endwalker playthrough. Shit just went down. So it's about time we did something about that. Let's go talk to these guys. Uh, in fact, we've already spoken to all these guys. Let's just talk to Lucia. Yes, that's what I thought. Uh, now that you've recovered, Lucia uh, would have a word with you. Oh, by the way, I've already collected all the Aether Currents bar this one. But that pretty much confirms this is the last MSQ for this map. Uh, are you well enough to make your report? This anima uh, was summoned with the corpse of Emperor Varus. Does their depravity know no bounds? Seems not. More to the point, we can surmise that the wave of ether issued from the Tower of Babel, um, but from the primal lurking within it. A primal whose cry rang rather more loudly in your ears uh, than ours. If you were taken to the tower itself, then this proves beyond a shadow of a doubt that the beaten heart of the cloth of Roy's machination. That is the beaten heart of the cloth of Roy's machinations. In which case, we have some highly relevant information. As many of you know, ever since we, depart, uh, we dispatched troops to free the Levieurs, we've been deploying a plan to infiltrate the tower. According to Thancred and his scouts, the main structure uh, is, um, I'm fairly sure it's not lousy with tempered, but that's what it looks like to me, uh, an enemy magitech. Furthermore, the road leading to it has collapsed, making it difficult to approach in numbers. Thus, we do propose dividing our forces into two parties, one to distract, one to infiltrate. The divisionary force would be comprised of Ishgardian, Ishgardians, Gridarian, yeah, Ishgardians, Gridarians, uh, and Limincian uh, delegations. There will begin the construction, or they will begin the construction of bridges to make the Tolothoi believe we are marching upon the tower. Meanwhile, the best suited to our, uh, mean, uh, meanwhile, the best suited of our Alamegan, Uldan, and uh, Eastern comrades will use a different method of ingress. Look here. This facility marked in red is the uh, Enchiladium, a vast Magitech manufactory, uh, and in ruins now, of course. Uh, but the freight tunnels connecting it to the erstwhile Imperial Palace remain intact. While the Tlothoi's attention is elsewhere, our infiltration force can be used to enter the tower undetected. Be aware, however, that the underground rail network remains very much operational. Uh, the, uh, the Tempered are using it to bring supplies to the tower, even now. If it can carry their materials, it can carry us too, proving, provided we sneak aboard unseen. The Scions will lead the infiltration party. Once inside, you must locate and dispatch uh, Van Daniel and Xenos. Uh, we'll save the people of Garlemord and those who suffered, uh, suffered uh, the world over. I'll have my vengeance yet. Absolutely not. Uh, it's time we ended this once and for all. Unlike in the latter one. Aye, and there will be no more casualties of the Tlothoi's manic ambitions. How quickly can we enact this plan? Van Daniel made it quite clear that haste is a priority. A paramount concern, even, assuming uh, he didn't name the tower Babel on a whim. In Ammon's time, it meant Gateway of the Gods. 
Um, Xandus used to refer to it as a void gate, uh, but in this case, it almost certainly alludes to something altogether greater. The eldest and the most powerful of primals. All the more reason to act now. Uh, the rest of the con uh, congregation is awaiting the plan, or is aware of the plan, uh, and are ready to move at a moment's notice. You are to proceed to the uh, north to Forum's, Forum's Patents. Uh, Lisa's group will meet you there. As ever, we are grateful for your foresight. Uh, this is the moment we've been waiting for. Uh, spare no efforts in your preparations. I am basically ready to go. Maybe with the exception of I may need to mend a thing or two, but I think my gear is fine. Yeah, my gear is fine enough. We're heading straight up. We're heading straight up. Okay. We'll see you there. And we're here. How are, how are you two not frozen to death? The sun does not sneak. However, he will travel this path of yours. Uh, and those who walk with him will bask in his radiance. No, sorry, I'm not trying to talk to you. Sneeze. Damn these fridges lands. Not <laughs> Good, <laughs> at least that's consistent. I am to accompany you into the tower. It is an honour, as ever. Nathan, uh, the way into the tunnel is clear. I, I, uh, we've made sure of it. I wish you'd make sure to bring a coat, <laughs> a coat instead. Uh, then we best get in there before we freeze, especially you. Uh, now let's go with the top one. Oh, I'll warm up when I throw a punch or two. Hmm. Barely enough clothes to swaddle a newborn. Clearly, you have spent too long around this feral dog of a Dothral. Dothral. Watch your tongue, fool. At least I feed it to the crows. We'll see who's the fool when you freeze to death. Expect me not to warm your ill-prepared hide. Those furs are for myself and my... Uh, ah, Nahalman? Am I Nahalman alone? That's wrong, but um, I should be blessed to meet her this day. As if any woman of worth would wish to be warmed by you, little son. Uh, should we find such a warrior within, she will bask in my glorious flames. Stop, both of you. Save your fire for the enemy. Uh, and as for extra furs, I have plenty to spare. As do we. They've all taken their coats off. Am I going to be too hot inside this building? Hello, everyone. Uh, hello. Oh, hello, everyone. Uh, all set for battle, I see. Yes, free of unnecessary encumbrances. Uh, if rather more s uh, susceptible to the cold. Let us review our strategy, quickly, if you don't mind. Pippin's group has gone ahead to the um, uh, Inchiladium. Yeah. <laughs> we have to meet them there. We wait until the Tempest's attention is drawn by our diversionary force, then we sneak onto the train. Next stop, Tower of Babel. Babel? 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 Tower of Babel. I think both is technically correct. I don't think either one is objectively wrong. I think there is a more common pronunciation of it between the two, but I think they're both accepted. Um, if any, tempered included, are injured, um, we, or we, Zexel, uh, will tend to them. You science must press on, no matter what. Uh, we should, oh, we should avoid moving as a group until we're underground. Uh, so we need to make our own way to the. Uh, each le each See you there. I did. I have pronounced that three different times or, or three ways, three times now. 
Just head north, you'll reach the place soon enough. Oh, hang on a second. Uh, who could possibly uh, be cold at a time like this? My heart is pounding with anticipation. Uh, we'll stage our depart or stagger our departure so as not to raise suspicions. You go on ahead. When I infiltrated the pious, uh, palace with Gaius, we took the or took an entirely different route. Since then, the whole pal place has been reconstructed, uh, and would appear that the path is no longer accessible. Cold? Nay, nay. I can I can feel nary a thing, nary a thing. And you're one hundred percent certain you're fighting fit. Um, no odd spectres um, haunting your wake. Uh, not oh, nothing feels tingly. Uh, I think it's time I was off. If I took Uyanji for one more, or if I look at Uyanji for one more moment, I'm liable to freeze solid. Fear not, no serious wounds have gone untreated, uh, nor will I stand for being left behind with the rest, while the rest of you rush headlong into danger. So you needn't bother suggesting it. Very well then. I'm not going to take my coat off. I'll take it off once I am back in a city. Mostly because I am actually incapable of removing it until I am back in a city. Kind of a um, oversight on my part. I, I, I actually can't change. Well, technically I could. I could remove the glamour, but we would get a different one in return. We wouldn't actually get the correct one. Now that the Tempered Ones uh, are aware of our plan, uh, they will doubtlessly start pouring in any moment. Mm -hmm. But you needn't worry, my brother and I will see that none shall pass. Uh, go forth and wreak your destruction. Hey, -oh, good to see you, Nathan. Uh, we heard uh, that you, or we, had, or we heard you that you collapsed, uh, but were given only the most cursory of explanation. Uh, I'm glad you recovered, uh, and quickly enough to take part in the operation of that. Uh, as you will have heard, we secured the way in. Some few are to remain behind to keep your escape route clear. Uh, our comrades, our comrades from uh, Lenitz Tia, uh, will lend the way, or will lead the way into the station. I'll join you soon. Uh, the station is right this way. Tread lightly. Now, proceed. Hmm, this place looks familiar. It's almost as if part of this was actually used for the um, place that Alpha Noah and Alize was kept. Although the door's technically in the wrong place. Is this, oh, this is everyone. Uh, consider the enemy well and truly distracted. Time to go. Our primary objective is, of course, the Tolothroy's leaders. But should we be presented with an opportunity to vanquish um, uh, Anima, we must seize it. If it is indeed the force behind the towers, destroying it will deliver our allies from the Tolothroy's reign of terror. And I, for one, uh, would not see the Garlean peoples manipulated any longer, uh, be it by Primal, Asians, or anything else. I have a feeling I might know where this is going. I'm betting the goal is for us to defeat Anima from the start so that they can channel that Aether straight into Zodiac to wake him up.
Here, here. Uh, there's been enough of that. Uh, we came to help the people of Garlemald, and that's what we're going to do, together. To the very end. The train should be along any moment now. Prepare to board, everyone. Tav Bay at Babel, now accessible. Ooh, who to take with us? Uh, do we want a small talk? There's a lot of them here. We could small talk with everyone. We've been doing that so far. <laughs> Uh, the train we're boarding is meant to carry supplies and armaments and the like. Uh, with any luck, we can slip past the tempered as they go about loading the freight. Strange. Uh, though this will be a more fearsome fight than any Nadam, I feel at peace. Maybe it's because I have um, a Sadu. A Sadu uh, Mang Mang ah, Magnus, I think it is, uh, and you at my side. Uh, maybe it's because we fight for all of all the exile. Uh, and people, more people besides. Uh, there is but one path, uh, that which leads to victory. It's likely that Anima, at least, will notice when we enter the tower. There's no point in trying to hide after that. So, when it comes time, don't overthink it, cut a path straight through. Your comrades tell me that the Tlothroi abducted you on the selfsame eve they so rudely interrupted our meal brazen feats that would make a Baduga proud. Uh, but even if it had not ended poorly, it was a disappointment in many respects. I had decided um, that when we returned triumphant, uh, the Auron would hold a far grander feast in, on the Azim Step. Uh, you have permission to attend. Aye, aye, kill no man. I've not forgotten your instructions. Uh, I must settle for crushing the Iron Men's toys. Uh, their blue blood will feed my flames. Uh, if we were only able to ascertain uh, that this tunnel connected to the tower, uh, I fear I have little to offer as to the details in the interior or the present situation therein. If Andana is to be believed, uh, we don't have the luxury of time to scout ahead. So we'll have to trust in your instincts. They've served us well thus far. Tis no, uh, no meager delight. Uh, Tis no meager delight to watch Alize and Alphano grow more resolute uh, in mind and heart, and remarkable through their accom uh, accomplishments. May and though and remarkable though their accomplishments may be, I doubt not that they are distinct, or destined for greater things. Grant them thy permission, Master Louis Solaris. Uh, I implore thee. Protection, not permission. If Van Daniel, uh, if Van Daniel truly is Armon, um, to create, if Van Daniel truly is Armon, to create a gate through which a primal may pass will not be beyond him. From what I gather, uh, he was utterly brilliant and utterly mad. Assuming Van Daniel's intentions to make Zodiac serve as a catalyst for the final days, one cannot but wonder if he's willing to part ways with the other Asians along. Uh, if he willingly parted ways with the other Asians long ago, surely they would not have permitted the very god they created to forestall the end of the world to be used in such a way. When Xenos murdered Varys, Gaius was upon. Uh, Gaius was upon him in an instant. Seldom have I seen such fury. I won't pretend to know the bond they shared, uh, but pain, fear, rage. I know them well. Uh, I know what can drive a man to drown in them. 
Though his homeland may, be, uh, may have wished for his blade, my lance will roar in its stead. I am only too aware uh, that our interventions, intervention may not be what many Garlemald's people want or need right now. Not every tragedy can be laid at their feet, or can be laid at the feet of the Torfoy. Certainly not uh, that Lucinda and her sister. Nevertheless, we must follow our conscience, and mine has led me here. As much as I'd like to be the one to wipe the grin off Van Daniel's smirking little face, I have lost sight as to why I haven't lost sight as to why we're here. Our ultimate goal is to prevent the Tlothoi from doing any further harm, no matter how. Uh, but if I do get the chance to introduce my fist to his jaw, and gods, I do hope I do, I won't turn it down. Who do we want to take with us? Who do we want to take with us? Hmm. I stand ever ready. Her insight would be good, but... It's technically a risk, risk to bring her, but the thing is, who I bring is kind of irrelevant as far as the plot goes. Our fates are not yet so we'll go with these four, three. Since none of them had the opportunity last time. Now or never. This music is bopping. Let us go. Uh, we best clear the train of fest before we arrive. Things could get nasty. In which case, let us not delay. I should have anticipated that these guys were going to come and hid before they arrived. Too late now. Slowing down, our destination must be close. Look, captives, uh, help me free them. You may leave them in our care.
yet to get into the tower proper, but it's fair certainty they know we're here. We did set off all the alarms. Or a moment's reprieve. Uh, from here, we um, from here onwards, we should split up into three groups and divide their attention. Well, who the hell is that? My beautiful boy, something or other. pushed away from that. Trying to figure out the mechanic on the fly. Got it just in time. Although Graha, would you mind actually positioning him in a way that I can... I guess that's a no. Oh, that's okay. He's being recentered. Who am I tied to? Oh, I'm tied to him. So again... Pushed away. I was worried I was about to lose that for a second. the wrong buttons. Ran away. Hardly seems worth chasing. Let's remember to actually get all of these chests this time. Uh, the alarm should be disabled now. With that, I believe we can use the lifts. It also shuts up that annoying sound, and we can listen to the music. What could possibly, what could they possibly need such an enormous lift for? They do like their enormous lifts. I mean. You weren't in the Praetorium, but they had plenty of giant lifts in there. If we can get everyone to the centre, please. Thank you. Now hold your positions. Best you can.
together. I have made a mistake. Waste of some good experience. For sure, we're one level over, but this dungeon will still be good experience because it's still at level. Allow me. Be gone. Probably the last group of them. Our paths diverge. Let us see who uh, who gets there first. Jess. Hmm. I sense danger, but you sense it too. Yes. Oh yeah, I meant to um, turn off party effects. I had them on Love while me. I was doing my test, but I didn't begin to disable them. Character. Party limited. Done, let's go. There's our chest. Tank Buster. No. Be gone. I should have saved that charge, but fortunately. Okay, so you want to be going to the other one then. Okay, that turns you into a toad, that minimizes you, so it's going to depend upon what ability he uses. Oh, they're Bomberman mines. Am 
my detect chakrams. We want to be underneath those. Allow me. I will not hold back. Hold still. Downpour, it's going to be frog, but I can kill you before it kills me. Huh. Uh, curses, you may have bested me, but you're no match for Lord Xenos. Uh, a fitting end for one so put to five. I'm inclined to agree. Nothing like good old fashioned explosives. Yeah, just. Battle chip chat. I almost never read the in or oh, battle chip up because I'm paying too much attention to everything else. Okay, so this stuff is as good as the stuff that I have. They wouldn't, would they? I shall deal with these whelps. Don't mind them, just skip past. Looking for hidden chests. We're heading in the right direction. This lift is fast. One animus. Together we shall overcome this. Thankfit, why did you go in the underneath that thing when that thing was clearly a trap? I've not got Van Grid with me, it's Graha, isn't it? Looks like the AI is quite sure it knows what to do with um, those ground things. Allow me. Be gone. Oh, everything else is dead. Oh, not the whole use of ninjutsus. Oh, don't fight them there! Hold still!
I imagine that would actually hurt me way more than it hurts those guys. This looks like a dungeon that people are going to mega pull in. Or mega pull in. And then immediately regret it because there's way too many here. I predict there being a lot of deaths from overconfident tanks or tanks that haven't bothered asking the healer whether or not they are okay with the size of all their planets. So we were told Anima was supposed to be a trial, so why does he look like he's going to be a dungeon boss? All that I have and more I bring to bear. Icon of Icons, Anima. All the halls of Alec cannot compare. This direction this boss. Damn it, you have to take those real far. <laughs> Half-Iron Wars tear the fabric of reality. Animus's dimension. Expecting a particular something to happen. There we go. <laughs> reality plunged into chaos. Oblivion.
Something special for you. Found this pain. I don't even know what this does. Get away from that. Blank. Make ready. We have so many of these things, we may as well use them. <laughs> But we were told this was a trial. We were also told the Major Sisters were a trial. <laughs> well, we're not so much told as heavily implied. Let's be diplomatically correct here. Agony made flesh. How could love for one's nation give rise to such a monstrosity? What does lay uh, within these countless vials? I mean, I suspect. Garleans. The orchestration of chaos is now nowhere to be seen. Where are Zenos and Pandaniel? No one would wish for such an abomination. Thancred. Thancred. Anything to say, Thancred? Thancred. There we go. Uh, the embodiment of Guardian's hope and dreams, eh? May the gods have mercy on your soul. Come, the other two await. All according to plan. ends here oh hush this is the best part Enough! <laughs> I recognize that. Some manner of magical defense. Hydalin, that's Hydalin.
Cryle? Cryle? But how? Hiding. The shackles that bind my adversary will not be so easily broken. Hiding. Feeble relic of a forgotten age. Hark! Victory is mine! Almost. No more ether. And I was so close. My lord, a slight change of plans. We shall travel to the moon and break this wretched barrier ourselves. Whatever it takes. What was that? The final order issued by Anima to the Tempered Thralls. Destroy its foundations! Should the Empire fall, the world must share the fate. Of course. Father lacked the conviction to give such a command. The abomination born of his flesh was but a puppet, and I the puppeteer. You madman, you monster! There's a funny joy in watching your flailing attempts to fight the inevitable. You're all going to die, and they're powerless to prevent it. Allegan teleporter. Be on our way. You're welcome to give chase, provided you are content to leave comrade and tempered alike to die screaming. Too much of this child. Tend to her. The last bram at Mare Lamentorum is yet unbroken. Zodiac remains bound. I have shifted the flow of ether and sent the enemy far from their destination. Now, I shall divert it once more. An ally awaits, and I will deliver you unto him. Seek his aid. Restore the seal. Zodiac must not be set free. The Tempered are running wild. Not only those at the tower, but those back at the camp. The others are doing their best to contain them, but the situation is growing beyond our control. Leave them to die or give up the chase. Just like Van Daniel said. Uh, I'm the one Xenos wants. Only I can bring an end to this. Garlemald's fate is in your hands. Um, yeah. Let's go with the bottom one. That's a lot of mouth moving for the such a short sentence that I said. You're... you're going alone? A 
is the best option and you know it. You hate it, but you know it. You have our trust and our faith. I pray we have yours. Why do you think I'm leaving Garlemore to you guys? Our friends in the Tempered need our help. We will save as many as we can, I swear. Once we have matters well in hand, we'll join you on the moon. Until then, be careful. There's no telling what you'll find. Tiny bunny people. And slender cactars. I forget the name that the community has given them. Hmm. Do I want to end on the moon or start on the moon? We can't get an angle up on it from here. Damn. As I suspected. We have no time to worry or worry in over what is done. Let's go. Stand there for just a moment, please. Prepare for good luck. Now you can't possibly fail. She paid respects. Uh, we're moving out. Uh, we're moving out to rendezvous with the remainders of the contingency. Leave everything here to us. She channeled a dangerous amount of ether, and that's to say nothing of the teleportation magic she must have used to get here. Yet Kryle and Heidelin both were clearly willing to take the risk. Hmm. Fear not for Kryle. Go forth and return. I put the... I put the... Put the... If all of the Tempered are affected, um, Julius and his comrades likely put up quite the struggle. Uh, we'll find a way to save them. We must. Uh, I only pray we are not too late. In the meantime, may the Twelve carry you to victory. You may out into blah 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 blah. We can fly! We didn't unlock the entirety of the map though. We're missing a square. I'll get it in my own time. Hmm. We know we're going to the moon. So at this point, it's just standing on ceremony if I go to the moon now. So we'll do it next time, which I'll have to start recording immediately, otherwise getting back to here to start this mission is going to be a pain in the ass. So yeah, we shall make our way up here. Can we get an angle on the moon? That's all? No? No, we can just make it glow with us. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the show, and hopefully... I will see you next time as we take a trip to the moon. Cheerio.